night heading to an antique store that I seen on the highway here that had a coin sign. I'll show you guys what the coin sign says. Free coin appraisal, booth, booth 156, ask for Jim. So let's check this out. Booth 156, let's see what kind of coins this guy's got. Maybe we can find something cool. <laughs> All right, some old stuff there, no coins, some old hats, pretty big store here. All right, still looking for coins, no, nope, nope, nope. Some yard sale stuff, in my opinion. Oh, ah, silver plated. Nope. Shot glasses. Come on. Show me the good stuff. Ah, here we go. Here's some coins. Here's Jim's booth. $3 each, silver dimes. Some more coins down there. Got some some V nickels right there, two dollars each. Steel pennies, forty five cents each. Buffalo nickels, no date, thirty five cents. Buffalo nickels with date, buck thirty five. And Jim is not here, so some coin supplies, some flips. Some tubes. If you got, if you always do what you always done, you will always get what you always got. Red books just in. Nope. Gone. Yeah, I just said that. Okay. It's got some silver half dollars, some walking liberties here. Not too bad price. Nine bucks a piece. Not in the greatest shape. So 1976 two dollar bills. Some graded coins. Not too bad. Not a not a super big selection, but uh you know, for an antique shop, this isn't bad at all. Still kind of cool. There's a good deal, I think, on that 2009 Silver State quarter set there. I have to double check my, my list. As usual, I don't have my list with me, so kind of a bummer. Do need some quarter flips and some nickel flips actually. Two bucks for 50 of them, that's not a bad deal. Some old cans, it's kind of neat. If you're into that kind of thing. I'm hoping to find some kind of coins. There's a silver set, plated. Six pieces for 50 bucks. That wasn't too great of a deal, I don't believe. Go downstairs here. That's kind of a pretty cool countertop. Kind of like something off Little House on the Prairie. A little different. Some dishes. Still looking for coins. Check this out. Antique printing press. Prints on silk for clothing. Eh, 
fifteen hundred bucks, but it's still cool looking. Kind of vintage. Little printing press. Got a big old wheel and belt there. That's pretty sweet. I don't know what you'd do with it. What in the world is this? This is excellent old yellow pointed swing churn. Davis swing churn patent. Date September 9th, 1879. 575 bucks. What's in here? Is it like a swinging butter churn or what kind of churn is it? Still kind of cool looking. Be a neat conversation piece. Hmm. Some deer heads. Yay. 80 bucks for that deer head. No, thank you. $175 with gun rack. Nice. It actually holds the murder weapon for you. Pretty cool, I guess. Not really. All right, if you want to see more of these videos, let me know in the comment section down below. If you haven't subscribed already, please do that and hit that like button. All right, thanks for watching.